In this time of year, when thoughts of sugar plums fly through our minds and the spirit of the baby Jesus smiles on us all, we find ourselves beset on all sides by the forces of darkness who would snatch away all that we hold dear on these holiest of days. Thankfully, a few brave men stand between us and that darkness. They are the heroes of the war on Christmas. So I'm at the Toys R Us. I'm getting my niece a Squawker's Macaw for Christmas. It was an uphill battle. I had to squeeze through a family of five to get to one. I'm not sure, but I vaguely remember possibly maybe stepping on a child. Anyway, I get to the counter, and the clerk, this kid, couldn't have been more than 20 if he was a day, takes my visa, rings me up, yada, yada, yada. And then he, the little son of a bitch, looks me in the eye and says, Happy Holidays. Happy Holidays. After that, everything went red. I don't exactly remember what happened next. But I do know when I was done, that kid was whistling Merry Christmas out his Yoo-Hoo. So I take myself, the wife and kids, out to the annual Christmas parade. It took us 40 minutes to get there, 20 minutes to find a parking place. <laughs> now, I'm all for inclusion and everything, right? I mean, I got no problem with the Kwanzaa float. I certainly didn't have a problem with some of those winter solstice dancers. I did get a little peeved with Maury the talking dreidel. That's only because he stepped on my foot. <laughs> But uh, when they finally got around to lighting up the holiday tree, that's when something inside of me snapped. That's when I went out to get that extra can of gas out of my truck. Now, it may have been a cinder when I got done with it. God damn it, it was a... Christmas cinder. So this year, our brain dead city council decided to put up a plain holiday display with plain garland and white lights in the trees. White lights. Everybody knows you celebrate the birth of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ with colored lights. It's in the Bible. Look it up. So, of course I had to complain. I was told the holiday display is inclusive of all beliefs. Yeah. Well, that's when I decided to get inclusive with my chainsaw. By the time I was done, the survivors were begging to kiss the ass of the baby Jesus. Wherever secular humanists rear their heads, Wherever Kwanzaa-loving commies dare raise a voice against the Virgin Mary. Wherever atheists dare to squat over the blessings of the day. These heroes will be there to say, Hey, asshole, pull up your pants.